Hey guys, this is uh, Texas Reaper 88 uh, coming to you live for another unboxing video that I got for you. This one comes straight out of Evike. Sorry, it's a little nosy because my AC's on. But anyways, uh, let's get to this unboxing because I know y'all wanted to know what's in here. So let's get into it. Get this right here. Alright, put this knife away. Okay, here we go. Uh, okay, there it is, buddy. Let's see what's in here. We have the gun. And we got... Six P mags, P, uh, PTS mags. Have six of these PTS mags. I got six of them. Two, three, four, five, six. Plus, I have two more. I have one for my airsoft guns, and I have another one in my vest. Plus, I got some Magpul ones. But, anyways, that's what I got those right here today let's get into the gun because mainly it's for the gun not for anything else and that is my beauty my new queen I have uh, uh, the new uh, uh, Elite Force VFC uh, Avalon series this is the V16 series I wanted the short one but they didn't have the short one Stock, but I got all of this from Evike. Uh, pretty soon we'll we'll let's see if I can get into it and open this all up. I thought this would have came with like the gun case, but it didn't come with the gun case. It just came with the the there we go. Here we go, here we go. That's nice. Sorry guys, this is all just one hand, so... My bad. Oh, yes. Here we go. Looks nice. Got a nice crane stock. Like the lightning. Bolt. Trigger. Finger rail. Uh... M lock series nice oh flash hider it's metal no yeah it's like a whatever it is but anyways it's got flip up sights let me see if we can so you can look through it got some flip up sights not really good, but they're back up anyways. Charging handle. Let's see here. It's supposed to... Uh... There we go. It locks and then the bolt catch release. Let's see if I can hit it with my finger. Okay. Snap clean there. Ambidextrous uh, select switch for righties and lefties. Needs a little work, I think. But, okay. Uh, finger trigger holder. Uh, then it's mag release right here. I think it should have been a little bit better. Maybe a little bit bigger. I don't know. See there you got the trademarks by VFC. See if we can get it in there real good. And then no other trademarks, no other things on here. It's a nice looking gun. Nice little M4. Um 
I will be using this one at Bulldog. I hope it doesn't miss up. But I'm hoping to use it for Bulldog uh, next week or so. I'll be out there with it, trying it out. If it doesn't really work, well then, I guess I'll put the Polestar engine to it. Or if not, I'll send it back to get a new one. But I like the body. I like the weight. I like the feel. Looks pretty good. Uh, crane stock. One adjustable here, you pull it. You can see. It's a little wobbly on the crane stock, just a little bit. It's all right. What do you expect? It's airsoft. Uh, it's got a sling adapter right there. Uh, for like uh, the the slings right there, that little that point there, and a that point right there. You can have it with the one point sling. Uh, I thought the thing would close, but it doesn't close. Oh, it does. Cool. Uh, other than that, pop up unit. Uh, everything looks pretty decent. Well, that looks all right, as you can see. Uh, we'll be having a chrono test in a little bit once I'm done with this I'll do a chrono and I'll do a range and accuracy and tell you how it's formed all right guys this is uh, Texas Reaper 88 signing off uh, please comment subscribe peace out peace what see you on the field